You know, when the draw for the group stage was made, I think most fans had their eye on this match. Two of the very best in Europe, and it has pride of place on the fixture list. It's Borussia Dortmund. They face Manchester City, and it's live right here on EA TV. One of the great, most atmospheric venues anywhere in the football world. We're at the home of Borussia Dortmund. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner, Stuart Robson. And very excited to be bringing you this group stage game from the UEFA Champions League. It is Borussia Dortmund facing Manchester City. Well, thanks, Derek. It's a real pleasure to be here. What a great atmosphere we've got inside the stadium. I'm really looking forward to this one. It should be a good contest, that's for sure. for Borussia Dortmund. Mats Hummel starts alongside Niklas Zule at the back. Torgan Azar starts with Julian Brandt in the wide areas. And the striker of choice is the powerful and lethal Sebastian Allaire. Starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Riyad Mahrez plays with Jack Grealish in the wide positions. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. And they get the ball rolling in this Champions League group stage confrontation. Henry Jan. Now with Zule. Zule. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Able to get a body in the way. But he can be such a difficult player to contain, Riyad Mahrez. What kind of performance do you think we'll see from him in this one, Stuart? Well, Derek, he's certainly going to be the key player today. Last time out, he scored those two goals, but it was his general play that was outstanding. Getting on the ball, making things happen, and he got his reward with the brace. And I'm expecting to see exactly the same again today. Phillips. Grealish. It's looking promising. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And over it comes. And the keeper taking care of the situation. Wonderful challenge. And a throw-in coming up. Well, that shouldn't really happen from a throw-in. And room now out on the flank. Holland. Are they going to forge ahead? Still alive. Grealish. Well, I have to say, that was an outstanding piece of goalkeeping. And most importantly, it stopped City from taking the lead. Yes, they just have to make sure they stay defensively compact here. That's not a bad ball. Well, still an issue here. Mares. De Bruyne now. Well, he's given us away. 
the referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City Placid away Laporte Joao Cancelo Holland it is advantage Manchester City here Mares oh fine stop And a short corner, let's see. An alert piece of defending. Walker. Here's De Bruyne. Keeper did his job to begin with. Great pressure to win the ball back. Surely. Well, just centimetres over the bar with that powerful shot. Brandt. Brandt. Delivering it into the box. And they deal with the threat this time. Takes the shot. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And there the first half ends here in Dortmund. Well, probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag. Yes, there's certainly room for improvement. He struggled to have any real impact on the game. He hasn't gotten the ball enough, and when he has, he's given it away cheaply. But I'm sure we'll see a marked improvement in the second half. And this Champions League group stage contest commences. It's looking promising. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. It's his advantage, Manchester City here. Mares! Oh, fine stop. Great pressure to win the ball back. Surely! And the second half of this Champions League group stage meeting is underway. Bernardo Silva. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Good looking pass. Well, offside anyway, albeit a tight one. A change in the offing for City. Sebastian Aller. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Throw in here for Borussia Dortmund. Royce. Able to get a body in the way. Wonderful tackle. Mares. He has time to play it over. Really vital interception here. De Bruyne. 
A lot to look forward to on the Champions League group stage front here on EA TV. Live, it's Borussia Dortmund facing Manchester City. That should be a tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Certainly one to enjoy. City move it forward with purpose. Cancelo. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Bernardo Silva and he's through here and still an opportunity Holland real chance Mats Hummels with that important block well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now dangerous ball A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? It is advantage Manchester City here. Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. No real threat, you've got to say. Creative look about this. This could square the game. A very timely interception. Joao Cancelo. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. And the cross goes in. And that will be that. The referee brings this match to an end and maximum points for Borussia Dortmund today. What did you think of their performance? Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, I think I can say without any fear of contradiction, Julian Brandt did his job. What did you make of what you saw from him? Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today. And this Champions League group stage contest commences. It's looking promising. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Disadvantage Manchester City here. Mares! Oh, fine stop. Great pressure to win the ball back. 
Surely. Dangerous ball. broken will that be the one that gives them the win and the cross goes in oh it's in and that might be the goal that clinches it for them no looking back now surely We simply have to focus on this man. Top scorer in the Champions League. Can he add to his total tonight? We'll find out soon as we're just minutes away from kickoff. It's live. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry. And alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you is group stage action from the UEFA Champions League. It's Dinamo Kiev taking on Real Madrid. Well, thanks, Derek. These nights are always special, and this shouldn't be any different. Everything is set up for a great game here. I'm really looking forward to this one. today for the hosts well although we have it down as a 4-5-1 it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1 they play with two holding midfield players a number 10 and two wingers the system has a nice balance to it And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Fernand Mendy starts with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Toni Kroos plays with Luka Modric in central midfield. And operating through the middle in attack today, Karim Benzema. And they get the ball rolling in this Champions League group stage confrontation. Vitaly Bujalski. This looks promising. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Beautifully disguised ball. Well, good technique in terms of how he struck it.
Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, Derek, he comes into this game full of confidence because in the last match, he was outstanding. Oh, Stuart's a chance! In it goes! An early goal! No wonder they're celebrating! Well, as you can see, he's a dangerous runner with the ball. He has such good balance and pace. That's a top-class goal, isn't it? Action underway once more. A wake-up call for the Real players, maybe. Can they find a response now? Federico Valverde. And successfully cut out. Serhi Sidorchuk. Plenty of support here. And he might be through here. Well, didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision. <laughs> Able to skip past his man. It's got to be! Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. With Real Madrid behind in the game, a corner could represent an opportunity. Now sending it in. Well, really meat and drink to the keeper under the circumstances. Plenty of support here, but quick thinking defensively. And moving through the gears now, Benzema. They couldn't maintain possession. Perfectly fair tackle, and it will be a corner. And fired over by Kroos. Well, you're not going to bamboozle the goalkeeper with a corner like that. Making a bit of headway. Course. A bit sloppy in possession. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Throw-ins given. He has teammates around him. Real chance! Oh, a great chance it was. Goalkeeper has it. Vinicius Junior. Mendy. Karim Benzema in the thick of things. Luka Modric. Now with Benzema, it's in the net, thanks to Karim Benzema. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player.
And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. Well, to be candid, Aiden Azar has been a long way from his best, not really making the impact that we anticipated before a ball was kicked in anger, Stuart. Well, he's been very quiet so far. He just hasn't got away from his marker. He needs to find a spark from somewhere and start testing this goalkeeper. And they get the ball rolling in this Champions League group stage confrontation. Beautifully disguised ball. Well, good technique in terms of how he struck it. In it goes, an early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Able to skip past his man. It's got to be. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. With Real Madrid behind in the game. It's in the net, thanks to Karim Benzema. Underway then in the second half of this Champions League group stage confrontation. And taken away from Azar. Excellent ball over the top. Did look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Modric. Very quick thinking there. Well, as you can see, Real Madrid have controlled the possession, but unless they find some inspiration from somewhere, I'm not sure where the winner will come from. They certainly need to up the tempo. That's right, and priority number one here is to win the ball back. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. And into the last 30 minutes now. Well, possibilities inside the box, but nothing to worry about. Well, they're getting right on top of their opponents at every turn. Now a decent position. Well, the supporters think it's on. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Corner kick played in. Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Real chance. Well, choosing to chip, and it wasn't so very far away. Well, it was good vision, excellent technique, but not quite the end result it deserved. Denis Garmash. It's a weighted pass. A gift for any goalkeeper. Still level. Real Madrid continue to look for what could be a winner. Oh, they've done it! They forged ahead. 
And it might be the goal that gives them victory. Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Vitaly Bujalski. Could be a chance to break here. And he's broken free. Well, it would have been a chance, but the run was mistimed offside. Time for a change then. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. Vinicius Junior. Keeper getting the touch. Well, threat over for now. And the referee says that will do it. It's the end of the game and it's a victory for Real Madrid. The fans are going to be happy with this. Yes, Derek, sometimes it takes a while to eventually get the better of the opposition, and that was the case here. They kept going, and they eventually got their reward. Well, really, no complaints whatsoever about his performance in this game, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today. And they get the ball rolling in this Champions League group stage confrontation. Beautifully disguised ball. Well, good technique in terms of how he struck it. In it goes, an early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Able to skip past his man. It's got to be! Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. With Real Madrid behind in the game. It's in the net, thanks to Karim Benzema. Now a decent position. Well, the supporters think it's on. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Real chance. Well, choosing to chip, and it wasn't so very far away. Well, it was good vision, excellent technique, but not quite the end result. It was still level. Real Madrid continue to look for what could be a winner. Oh, they've done it! They forged ahead, and it might be the goal that gives them victory.